Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how I made this really beautiful cute mirror pedestal using items that I purchased from Dollar Tree. I saw this pedestal online for $200 up to $1,400. So if you're interested in seeing my version of the pedestal that I made for a fraction of the cost, then just keep watching. For this project, I used 10 of the Dollar Tree mirrors, three of the foam boards, three packs of the silver picks. I used two packs of the foil sheets. I only used the four pieces of silver metallic sheets in each of those packages. I used a silver metallic Sharpie. I used duct tape and I used tons of glue which included the fix all adhesive, my E6000 hot glue gun and glue sticks and my X-Acto knife. I'll have the complete list of what I used down in the description box. So the first thing I did was remove the mirrors from their frames. You won't need the frames for this project. And then using one of those mirrors, I traced six rectangles on each of my three foam boards. I then used my X-Acto knife to cut out those rectangle pieces. And when I was done, I had 18 pieces that looked like this. I then removed the hanging hardware from each of the cardboard backings from my picture frames and then I ended up with 10 mirrors, 10 cardboard pieces and 18 foam board cutouts. Instead of doubling my foam board to ensure it could support my mirrors, I simply used my hot glue and my fix all adhesive to attach one of the cardboard pieces and one of the foam pieces together. This gave me the sturdiness and the thickness that I was looking for. I used six of the foam board cutouts for each of the cubes, four that I attached to the cardboard, and the other two that I cut down to eight and three eighths inches on both sides. I then used a very thin layer of the Fix All Adhesive to cover both of those squares with my metallic foil sheets. And when I was done, I had something that looked like this. And then using my hot glue and my fix all adhesive, I began assembling my first cube. I added more hot glue and a piece of duct tape to the inside corners of my cube and when I was done I had something that looked like this. I let that dry for about 30 minutes and then using my E6000 and hot glue, I started attaching my mirrors. I added additional hot glue around the edges of the mirror and then I waited about 15 minutes before adding the next mirror. Once I added all four of my mirrors and let them dry, I turned the cube on its side and I added my two square full covered pieces to each side of my cube. And when I was done, I had something that looked like this. I then used my metallic Sharpie to color in the white piece of the foam that was showing. And then I used my silver picks to give my cubes a more finished look. 
I repeated those same steps to create my second and third cube, but I did not place a mirror on the bottom of my second and third cube because you won't be able to see that when I build my pedestal. And the only reason why I added it to my first cube was to add some weight to the bottom cube of my pedestal. To complete the project, I simply used my hot glue and E6000 to glue the cubes on top of each other, slanting the center cube slightly to mimic the design I saw online. And here was my finished look. This turned out really pretty guys and was very simple and inexpensive to make compared to the versions that I saw online. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If so, please like, comment, and share. And if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And be sure to turn on your notifications so that you don't miss my next video. Remember, I upload new videos every single week. So until next time, guys, bye.